I would just like to say that um, I, uh, my colleague thinks that I'm extremely good at winding uh, people up around me. I'm very good at stirring the pot. Um, I'm not. I, wouldn't, I wouldn't, didn't use the word good, John. I said it's something that you do. Yeah, but it's nothing to be encouraged. Yes. Yes, but I, 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 I'm interested in the type of reactions I get from people, and sometimes they shout at me about it, and then yes. storm off. Yes. Or tell me to shut up. Yes. <laughs> One of these things are possible. Yes. <laughs> But the audience, I wonder if this. I wonder if the Phonic FM audience listening to the We Not well, what Know are you show talking about? Just, just, find me annoying. Do the ah. Oh. So, if if you do find me annoying, and yeah, uh, you're not and, trying to wind up the audience, though, are you? John? No. You're, you're, you're... Uh, if you do, if, yeah, but I see myself. If if you do find me annoying, please let me know. By phoning into the studio or on Twitter. I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm highly interested in, 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 in how much I annoy people. <laughs> well, John, what I'm, tr what I'm trying to suggest to you, I mean, this comes out of how you behave over a cup of coffee or something. Yes. But if you're, if you're claiming it's a form of journalism, this is sort of your, a radio persona. Yes. For the reason, for the reason of getting a response. Um... <laughs> I, I'm going to suggest we need a, a wider range of, of methods. Right. Because um, when we start doing this, I well, I, I, in some ways I agree with your methods. As, as radio, I think it's reasonable. Um, we were saying, for example, that FM was going to come to an end. Yes. Um, which was a strange thing to say as radio presenters. Well, But we yes. were trying to upset the management. Yes, yes, but you. I feel that CDs have had their day, even though you can still get CDs. Um, I think it's much more convenient for people if you look at it statistically on how much people Go a little closer, people use online methods to to to, to buy music these days. It's much more that you hear of CDs less and less. Well, yes, I'm I'm quite happy with CDs. So let's let's all right. Let's take that as as an example, because um, the ma the 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 man the board the the people who started um, Phonic FM who put energy into keeping it going they they quite like CDs. Mm. Um, so you you're likely to find the CD. At least one of the CD players is probably working. Yeah, well, I mean, at, at any one time. Whereas the the internet, which we've been going on about, it's working at the moment. We can't complain at the moment. Yeah, but I'm just saying it's more common for people to use online methods to 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 buy music these days. Yeah, but I would what I'm what I'd suggest to you is that this is now quite well known. Yes. The, 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 there's lots of evidence that radio is part of a mix of methods by which ra new music is discovered or distributed or whatever. Mm. So we don't have to thump the table and annoy people, necessarily. Right. We could just say, well, um, what do you think is going on and um, how are you coping with all of this? Because we don't, we don't, we we haven't got any better ideas. We're still doing a radio show, yes, of, of a sort. I'm going to play three doors down here, here without you. Okay. <laughs> 